This scientist can catch cancer just by smelling your breath. Let me tell you his incredible story. See, when I was a kid, I thought if you get cancer, it means you're dead. It is one of the deadliest diseases and more than 10 million people die from cancer every year. But what if there was a way to catch cancer before it spreads in our body? That's what this guy is building. Hi, Nas Daily. My name is Hassam Haig and I'm a professor in the Technion and I have made a device that can find cancer using your breath only. Professor Hossam is a Palestinian scientist from Israel, just like me. His life changed when he found out his best friend had cancer. When I was a PhD student, my good friend called Ellie was diagnosed with cancer and I was very touched by seeing his suffering from the treatment of cancer. That's when he decided to dedicate his life to medicine and find a new way to treat cancer. Today, you could have cancer in your body and you don't even know it because there are no symptoms. So Professor Hossam thought, instead of trying to find cancer after it spreads, why not catch it before it spreads? I have read Hippocrates has used his nose in order to smell many types of disease from breath. He learned that diseases can change the smell of your breath. In fact, dogs can detect cancer and other diseases just by smelling a person's urine and breath sample. So Professor Hossam built a device that works just like a dog's nose. This is the Nano's device. Here is how it works. In our body, when a cancer cell grows, it releases tiny molecules that try to escape your body. These molecules travel to the lungs, where they mix with the air our lungs release. So if you have a cancer cell growing inside your body, the air you release will have these cancer molecules. And that's where Nano's comes in. When you exhale into the nanos, the device will study the breath using nanotechnology and AI. It will look for those tiny cancer molecules, and if it catches them, it will signal an alert. And that's how this machine can tell if you have cancer or not, even before any of the symptoms show, just based on your breath. When we have started our research on breath analysis, we have collected the breath from healthy and from diseased people. One of the healthy cases has told us that he knows that he has no disease and that he has done a CT before a few months and he's sure that he's healthy. Nevertheless, when we have done the breath analyzer using our device, we have discovered signs for cancer. A few months later on, it was discovered that there is a tumor inside the lung. Before, you had to go to a doctor to get tested for cancer, and millions of people don't do that or can't afford to. With the nose, you can test for cancers, Alzheimer's, Parkinson's right from your home, even if you live in a remote village in Ethiopia. This is the grand vision of Professor Hossam. These systems are so cheap and affordable that can be utilized by every person, whether poor or rich. His device is still a prototype and it's in production. And within three years, he says, we should be able to get this device in our hands. We hope we can afford equal opportunity for their health management and treatment. Professor Hossam gives me hope and gives you hope that it is finally possible to beat cancer and beat every other disease in the world.